All right, so here's what we got shopping, or here's the, what we picked up when we went shopping today, which is Monday. We've got frozen chicken, steam in the bag veggies, some bananas, some white peaches, green pepper, onion. Uh, I've got some mahi-mahi, some fresh uh, catfish, some 100 calorie thin buns, and some southwestern style egg beaters. One thing I'll let you guys know is one of my secret weapons is right here. These containers. These will actually let me put together my meals for the following days. It'll already be packaged up. It'll be in the refrigerator. And that way when I go to work, I can just grab a bag, take them with me to work, put them in the fridge, and I've got breakfast and lunch taken care of. So this is what a typical Sunday night shopping trip will consist of and what it will look like. And now we're off to cooking. So one of the things I'm going to be doing is grilling up some chicken. It's always good to weigh it if you can, uh, just so you get an idea of what X amount of ounces looks like. Um, that way you can, let's try that. So you can measure it. You can see I've got 4.6 ounces of chicken. Uh, that just helps you calculate how many calories of a certain type of meat you are cooking, eating, and uh, factor into your daily, or I will factor it into my daily calorie count. All right, and here we've got catfish, one of my favorites, grilling up right now. All right, for an hour's worth of cooking, now I've got food for two days. I've got here my eggs with green peppers and onions. I'm gonna split that in half for tomorrow and Wednesday morning. Here I've got lunch, which is eight ounces of chicken and mixed vegetables, steamed. And here I have dinner, which is grilled catfish, Brussels sprouts, and a couple onions. Now, I love Brussels sprouts, so that works for me. Love fish, love chicken, love steamed vegetables. I've also got some white peaches, some bananas, and a pack of 100 calorie buns. So, breakfast for the two days comes in at 210 calories. Split that in half, that's 105 calories. Each of my lunch containers is a total of 405 calories. And each of my dinner containers are 280 calories. So for the amount of food versus the amount of calorie intake, I'm doing pretty good. So I'll have to factor in some snacks to help round out the rest of my calories, but I don't really have too much of a problem doing that. Um, everything I cooked up, I cooked up because it's easy to do. Uh, the vegetables all steam in the bag in about five minutes. Uh, grilled chicken uh, is frozen, skinless, boneless chicken breasts. Throw those in the microwave for about eight minutes, I guess, and then uh, throw them on the grill, and they're ready to go. The eggs, I mean, a couple minutes for the eggs. The fish, slap it on again couple minutes each side you're done so it's easy that's pretty much why I got all this stuff is because it's very easy for me to put together it doesn't take much time and it basically takes all the guesswork out of what I'm gonna eat for the day so I take all these throw them in my fridge at work and when I get in in the morning have my eggs I'm good pull out a container of chicken and vegetables for lunch and I'm good and dinner I can either eat before I leave work or I can take it with me and eat it at home. But again, it's pre-packaged, so pretty simple. Um, I will probably be trying out different recipes. Um, very easy going when it comes to eating. I can eat chicken, fish, and vegetables for a number of days at a time in a row. But for my own sake, I'm gonna 
mix it up. Try some different things, look up some recipes, see what's good, see what's not, and report back to the vlog as I do. So again, here is pretty much my two days worth of food that I put together within about an hour. And yeah, so as you can see, it's, it includes my secret weapon, which are the Tupperware containers. And I'm uh, ready to go for the next two days. So until the next vlog, have a good night.